feel somewhat accomplished now that I that I did it all by myself, albeit taking like 45 minutes or something, I think. I'm gonna quickly read what my protagonist thinks this all means for me. Maybe he can make more sense of it. The probe tracking module. Uh, that's it. That's it. Just this. This thing. The orbital probe cannon has launched millions of probes. The 9,318,054th probe located the deep space anomaly matching all known criteria for the IFD universe. The statue in the probe tracking module automatically records each probe's trajectory and transmit the data to the Ashtrain project. I found Domai coordinates marking the location of the IFD universe. What do I do with that? I have the coordinates, but can I just... Wait, there's something new here, I think. Pass through the electric barrier and reach the coral forest at the planet's core. Yeah, but... I mean... Can I just put it in my... In my... Ship? The coordinates? Is there, is there like a map now? Is it on the map? Is that... Is that like... The thing around me? Is that the eye? Is that the eye of the universe? Have I found it? What does it mean? What does it do? Can I even go there? I thought I couldn't go further out than like Giant Steep. It has a different orbit than all of this other shebang. Do I just go there now? Is this the end of the game? There's so many unsolved mysteries and questions still. You know what? Let's fucking try. We're gonna see if we can even get there to begin with. Maybe it's not even possible. And I'm sure I've seen this thing before, like flying by and me saying, hey, what the fuck is that? Or something. I mean, it's glowing. I should have, like, just seen it by accident. I'm about to find out what the eye of the universe is. Would be a good moment to cut the episode down. I'm a little bit too quick. Are you the eye? Or are you just the module? Well, it's a little bit small, isn't it? It's like a satellite. Maybe I can read something on it. Uh, it has a number on it. There's a recorder there. I guess I have to... Wait. If there's a recorder... Wait, 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 wait. We're recorded. Don't fly away. Uh, quick, 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 quick. Get out. Unidentified signal nearby? Play. 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 Gabro here. Checking in on the deep space satellite per ground control's request to check out the possible equipment problems. See, Hornfelds? I do too work. You know, I wouldn't mind being a satellite. It's peaceful out here, among the distant stars and the soft velvety darkness. But it's yawn. Awfully nice for naps, too. Alright, the lens. Alright, little satellite. Let's see what the trouble is. Huh, everything looks A-OK, -okay, ground control. No dust or scratches on the lens. No evidence of sparking or violent explosions. Guess that rules out an equipment malfunction after all. Yeah, that pal, you're in great shape. Keep up the good work out there. That, wait, 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 wait. What? That's not the eye of the universe. It's a fucking satellite of ours. Uh, my, my... Deep space satellite, deep space radio. 
Do you need to have knowledge of like Morse code or something to make sense of this or? It's property of the Outer Worlds Ventures, so it's our stuff. It does record some like something. My ship is slowly drifting away. How the fuck did he get here? Do whatever the fuck he did and then get back to his ship. It is pointing at the sun, isn't it, though? Wait, can you enter? No. It's making pictures. The lens. Are they... Is this like a Truman Show moment? Are they recording all of this? <laughs> this is ironic, considering I am. What does this tell me now? Sun. Deep Space Satellite. I don't have any other frequency for the Deep Space Satellite than this. my ship. I can't get there still, I think. It is too far away. This is not the eye of the universe, though. Was this here for it? Like, was this here from the very beginning? I just didn't find this satellite? Was... No, that can't be it. Can it? What? What are the coordinates then? Oh, no! Alright, next up, the Bramble Planet. I think, no, well, either that or the interloper or the tower still, but I'm so incredibly stumped by the tower, <laughs> I feel like I should do something else for, for breath of fresh air. Um, wait, so the satellite thingy didn't, it didn't give me anything at all? Is that right? It must have been here from the very beginning. So this thing is orbiting the sun. Where the fuck is the eye? That's Whitehall. The distortion is in effect even on the map. Let's go to Dark Bramble then. Fuck if I know. <sighs> oh, look who it is. I know it's the Ash Twin. I thought it was the Quantum Moon, but this is the Quantum Moon. I wonder if the Quantum Moon needs to be in a certain position. Like, maybe we can enter him when he's close to the Ash Twins. You know what I mean? Like, that could be another condition. Hey, you can only enter when, like, it's not that time of the month, you know? There are a few conditions like that in life. And you too will get to experience them, I'm sure of it, but... Yeah, whatever. I don't know where I'm going with this. Why does my scout disappear? Wait! 
Uh, what if I can... Was that a shadow? Wait a second, what's that on top? Like the swirly thing. No. Um, what if I can only enter, not with a ship, but with my... But if I leave now, I won't see it anymore, right? What if I can only enter by person? Let's try to get inside of it and then unbuckle. Just, just barely touch it. No! Just fucking disappeared! Oh, fuck. Okay, let's go to Dark Bramble then. Fuck this shit. Fuck this. Why am I even trying? Why am I even trying? This is Bramley Bastard. Where did he go? Oh, oh shit, well, all the way over here. Uh, wait, no, this. Ah, <laughs> oh, god damn it. This game is slowly but surely breaking me, I think. I am. I'm losing my mind, surely? But I'm not sure if I'm losing my will either. <laughs> it, man, imagine. Being me, just for a quick second, I don't know, you don't want to do this to yourself, but just imagine trying to make sense of this when you have like the brain capacity of most likely one of the jellyfish we've see we've seen earlier. So So what's the deal with Dark Bramble? Where do we even land? Like light coming out of it or something. Is there anything on these land masses I can see? It's around it a little, little bit. There's fawns on the brambles. And there's what looks to be like an inviting hole asking me to enter. And you know what, if I see an inviting hole, I, I do have to enter, but we're going to shoot something in first. If it's similar to what we've seen on our planet, then it's going to be bigger from the inside, right? Oh, I missed. Yeah, how the fuck does this even work? Like, in-engine-wise as well. Oh shit, did you see what it just flew past? I'm a little bit afraid, to be honest. It landed somewhere, only 500 meters from me, but... No, 2.1 kilometers, actually. It does really feel a little bit like entering a vagina for the first time, I gotta say. <laughs> What's the red light? Should I bother? The red light can't be good, and now I've lost my location drop. Oh god, yeah, there's fucking these anglerfishes. Is, are these the lights? The anglerfishes. Don't fly into them then. F fly on the side of it or something. I also don't want to crash into one of these fawns. They look very fucking bad. Maybe the red light is actually good. Yes! The red light seems to be another thing I can enter. Wait, I need to hit it first, okay. Yes, okay, if I go this way... 
will be able to enter the red light. The anglerfish are below me, so they're just. I don't know. It's. I'm. I'm afraid. Like, if the gameplay tricks on me with the size of things, can it play any further tricks on me with the distance of things and how to get there? I mean, it does with the whole quantum stuff. So if I just go along this like brambly path, I will be able to reach it though. Or what was that? What was that? Do I have any other windows? No, only below me. <laughs> uh. Why does it sound so fucking menacing? I definitely don't want to go out. Where is it? It sounds so close as if it's right behind me. That would be scary as shit. I need to course correct. Oh shit, there's more of them in here. Are you kidding me? Oh. Uh. Is it right behind me actually? Duplicate signal. Oh my god, there's so many of them! Ugh. It also seems to be right above me. I can't tell, but the sound of it and the shadow apparently. I'm fucking shitting myself right now. What is it? What's it is, why does it show me the lights only when I'm in the ship? Or oh, maybe I should go on foot? No, <laughs> surely that can't be the smart idea to do here. <laughs> Duplicate signal? So I have two scouts now? What is that? What does it mean by duplicate signal? What is that? Bubbly thing, it looks like bubble tea. Wait, are, aren't anglerfishes... are they blind or not? Oh, it, it stopped. Oh my god. Aren't they blind or something, as long as I don't bump into them? <gasps> oh my god! Well, okay. <gasps> Did I bump into this one? Or it was right as I pressed shift to, to course correct. Do you know anything about anglerfish? Let's read. Reading is for the smart people. Reading is good. Reading helps you understand things better. Except for if you don't understand what you read, then it makes you feel dumber. Wait, they didn't update anything at all? Are you shitting me? Are you...
It gives you a fucking hint towards the cyclone on this picture. Test the environment. Should you scout into a cyclone to see what happens? Wait, the other pictures. Illuminate dark areas, that's another hint. See beyond the horizon. Detecting hazards, I feel like I've did this one as well, but what they mean what did they mean by see beyond the horizon? I feel like a right fucking idiot seeing this here, I gotta be honest. <laughs> oh, I shouldn't laugh about this. Maybe spot a tree, walk towards it. Enjoy. Maybe there's more hints in here. I just need to pay attention. Who made these like Who counted? On 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 the, on on the console and if this just straight up says oh this is the of the universe by the way I'm gonna scream okay hollow land and brittle hollow giant steep with the this penis station there's this thing which is unaccounted for could be the quantum moon but who knows a dark bramble with the light in it and the horrible monsters the hourglass twins the sun station is not depicted here. How does my ship look work, by the way? How does it retain its information? Is that the game thing, or can this be explained by something? Because sometimes when my ship gets destroyed, shouldn't information be lost as well, then? Well, I fucked around a lot. Do they usually start at, like, nighttime? It's daytime now. <laughs> Yeah, I fucked around quite a lot. Oh, I... I give me a second. <laughs> I I am... Like, the, the hairs on my neck are standing up right now, and the hair on my arms as well. I have, like, what's it called? Like, chicken skin or something? I think it's called in English. That's... It didn't even really scare me. It just got me so, so much that... I don't know what to think about this. I... Well, looks like I'll return. Look, even... Oh, the quantum moon is there to cheer me on. We can still do the interloper thing with as soon as the crack opens, I jump in. This time instead of running away, I think that was the problem last time. I was too scared. <laughs> Getting close to the sun. I was a little bit too... not Like, not enough like Icarus, basically. So... <laughs> Oh, maybe it's sound, actually, that they react to. Like, if I start my engine, of course I make a sound, right? That means I have to... I have to float? What's that bright light? Seriously, what is that bright light in the distance there? Is that even a thing, or am I, like, going towards something... Non-existent again, because I can't mark it. Is that the Whitehall station? It must be Whitehall. It is Whitehall. It is Whitehall station. Alright, let's return to, to, to the Bramble Brothers. The fishy is deep inside. And what could the bubbly thing at the end be? How would I even get past so many of them, though? Because if I float, I can't course correct. And if I can't course correct, then how, how do I do that to begin with? Do I need to scan out, send out my scout ahead to see if I have the right approach, or...? Oh, this is horrible. I thought this game was, like, very easy on, like, the gameplay side. Very hard on, like, the brain side, but... Wait, wait. Do I need to go f to what? Like, what is what is the other stuff? Let's see if we can shoot it towards the white, the white stuff. 
the white lights. I know, constant clicking. It must be grating on your ears. I don't think I even hit the white signal. It just stands out to you, you know, the, the red stuff. The red signal. It's just nothingness now. Is it literal nothingness inside of here? That's why you... Oh no, here we go. But that can't be it. Oh my god, they are so fucking ugly. I think... Oh, maybe these are like... Portals to other, like... Like, one of these could be the portal to... Um, whatchamacallit? Uh, Timber Half. I feel... It, why is it so hard to, like, hit... Hit the spot? Yeah, these are other nodes. But is there any reason for me to want to go to the white one? Uh, the red one, even? Okay. Uh, let's give us a boost and let's go. I can't course correct. So... How did I do it the first time around? Well, they're not here yet. Maybe I just can't do it close to them? They were very close just now. I thought I could just float past them. For a second I, float, I thought they were dead as well. And maybe just decoration or something to scare me. I would put it past this game to just do this to you. Something like a mannequin that you know it must come to life, but in the end it doesn't. Okay, we're getting close. It isn't even that far away, is it? The red one. Can it just enter from, from any side? I didn't even pay attention to that. Why is it red? It's the only one that's red. The others are white. So, it must have some significance. I can still hold space to match velocity. Is it still of the planet? Um, marked or something? Can this, can this be? No, wait, down a little. And up again. And, like, okay. okay. Just. Just try my best. If I bump into them, let's see what happens. Oh, yeah, okay, he turned towards me as soon as I. Is he gonna eat me? Because I. Okay, that got me. I can't, even for a tiny split second. I can't even accelerate or decelerate or anything else at all. <sighs> this is legitimately stressful. I, I don't know about like anyone else, but my heart is pumping really crazy. It feels like <sighs> If I get a heart attack due to this game, who's going to take care of me? Honestly. Who's going to call 911 six months into the future? <laughs> because that's when they see this. <laughs> right, where is it? Uh, it's giant steep. Always there when you don't need it. Uh, come on, shouldn't be too hard to find. Should do the 360 trick again. Here we go. Let's engage the autopilot. Hopefully, we don't crash into the sun. Yeah, I should abort the autopilot. Let's do it by myself. It should be possible to land on the sun station. Like, if I play my cards right with my, like, velocity thingy. It's something I've learned in, like, the recent sessions. 
really rather than at the beginning when I try to get there. You retain a lot of speed, you need to brake very early and like match velocity is your friend. Unlike the Quantum Moon, who's a little bitch that just doesn't want to be conquered. I don't even know its significance to the story. Okay. So I'm, gonna, I'm gonna try this like two, maybe three more times. If I can't do it by then, I, I feel like I need... I might... I might need a further hint as to as to how to do this, I guess. And there should be there should be one somewhere. I've read about I've read about where did I read about it? Actually No 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 dude 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 stop I don't want to enter. We just Where was it? I've read about... Hey, there was this... Um, anglerfish here. We learned how to how to deal with it through this. Where was it? Was it on the amber thingies? Anglerfish fossil! Found a cave with an anglerfish fossil inside, but the opening is only big enough for my scout. The gnome I learned how to evade anglerfish, theoretically at least, by studying an anglerfish fossil they found on amber twin. An ember twin. They learned how to evade anglerfish theoretically, at least, by studying an anglerfish. This is orange. There's still something for me to learn. So maybe, maybe I'll have to come back to this. An ember twin to study the anglerfish fossil. But I remember ember twin being very, very um, stressful as well with the whole sand business going on. So if possible. I'd like to avoid that. Also, if possible, I'd like to enter one of these white ones. Sometime in the future, I guess. Okay, I can still course correct in here. Apparently there's no anglerfish here. None that I can see, at least. Or here. What was the thing I heard earlier? Oh, here we go. There they are. They are here, they're just very far away. Not as close as they are in the other one, like in the node. Let's call them nodes, or knots. I'm about to be knotted. Is that the correct term when I enter? Or do I not when I enter? There's a node here. Already. Very close. Maybe I have to do it in person, like get enough of a run-up speed and then like go through because obviously I'm smaller. But I feel like you know, I don't want to be swallowed by this these things while not in my ship. While in my ship it feel a little safe outside of my ship. Looking at this, not safe at all. Not safe at all. I wonder if you can outrun them. Can it just just need to do it just go quick or Do I have any speed right now? Am I getting any closer? Well, I guess yeah, okay, I can tell if I shoot a scout oh, pardon me. If I shoot a scout I can tell that I'm getting closer since the scout is getting closer as well. Oh. I also need to pee and I'm afraid of like accidentally leaking. When I get scared, which is a real possibility at this point in the game, like just the tiniest amount of scare could like spell an accident, I guess. So just floating there, instinctively, I somewhat did the right thing. 
I was just going slowly because I was afraid of what to find. How close do I need to be to it for the anglerfish not to trigger anymore? I mean, I can hear him breathe, so he should be somewhat close, right? Can I cross correct but just... Apparently they don't mind if I move my ship, do they? That's what I'll try out next. So I can, theoretically... Just with a tiny, tiny gesture I can move away from them. God, I definitely need to be a little bit quicker when I enter. I'm afraid of doing it now though, since I came so far. I might as well go the rest of the way this slowly. It is very fucking slow though. Am I even, am I even getting s closer? I am! With speed of about one meter per second. That's not good, is it? It's a little bit too slow. <laughs> okay, I guess he heard that. I just accelerated for a split second, not even. Well, I'm a little bit faster now. Can I just keep, like, edging? Oh god, no, I can't. Well. Did he stop me? No, I'm still getting closer. He's right next to me. <laughs> oh god! You can actually see him like that. Look! There's his fucking eye! Is he the only one out here? It's the only one of them. Can you trick them by shooting the scout? I guess not. Otherwise they would, like... All jerk up as soon as I shoot a scout in here. However, I will I won't be able to thread the needle like that. Might have to go up a little bit more. And then enter from the top. So I need to be a little bit more to the right, I think. So I can get a good vantage point. Oh god, these episodes are getting weirder with like me doing the same thing for a longer amount of time without reaching any conclusion or managing anything, really. So I'm very sorry if this is even more aggravating to watch. Actually, I'm not very sorry, but I'm somewhat sorry, I guess. God, there's no second chances if I fuck this up. He's a little bit too close. If only they would move, you know? Like on a patrol or something. I feel like I'm slipping past. Yeah, I'm getting... Well, okay, that's it. Fucking eat me, then. I did get away from him. Can I get away from this guy, too? No. I can, okay, so these are, these are like teleports then. You can teleport in and out, okay. You get a, get a good, good vantage point. S stop, slow. Wait, why is there another red one here suddenly? Did I get teleported back out to the beginning of the planet? Is that it? I am back at the beginning of the planet. If you back out, you're out completely. Well, guess I'll have another try to to manage to hit this one. A little bit quicker this time, please. How did I do it right the first two times, but now I have such problems with it. Okay. 
Okay, my scout can just about edge through. Okay, that should be quick enough. And it should also lead me there. I did successfully evade them though. But how does it work? Is that like an like a game thing or is it like an in-universe thing that would teleport me out to the beginning of the planet? There's none here yet because I can't hear them when I accelerate. So there must be one close to it then. Oh, we're at a very awkward angle though. A very, very awkward angle. There it is. I think I can, I can just about do it. I can just about enter. Oh, okay, I can hear him now, which means I shouldn't do anything anymore. But can I even... I mean, I will knock against the wall. That's not really what I want, is it? So if possible, I want to... This one's going crazy. You know what? Jesus, take the wheel. I'm just gonna slow float now. I'll even do this, because then I don't even see them coming. 